being prepared doesn't have to take forever. It doesn't have to consume your entire life. And it definitely doesn't have to be negative. If you have a little fun, a little joy in the journey, you're going to get through it a lot faster. So, the topic today is toilet paper. Toilet paper. Mm, it's a commodity that is obviously, I would say, consumable, but it's um, disposable. There's the word. It's disposable. And it's one of the top things that a lot of people who stock up for any run on the grocery store or being holed up in their home or potentially an economic collapse like in Argentina and other countries have faced. It's a commodity that people get freaked out because they may not have enough on a shelf or in their home. So how on earth do you calculate exactly how much toilet paper you need? Super simple, make it easy for you. First off, put your brand new roll. You can fold that little corner down like they do in the hotels, make it really fancy. And put a little post-it note up beside it the day that you put it on the toilet paper holder. Use as directed by your body in one bathroom. For an average family of four, this is easy to do on one bathroom. If you only have one bathroom, you totally have this easy. Okay? Put the date on a little post-it note up on the wall. Start. The one that looks like this. Put your date down. Okay, if you have one bathroom, we'll just average it that it's only one person using that one bathroom. This way you have a surplus. Let's say it took you three days to go through a roll of toilet paper. Well, an average week is seven days, obviously. Well, on average, pretty much the whole week is seven days. If you have four people and you went through two and a half rolls a week in one bathroom, you multiply that two and a half times four you end up with, yeah, that. That's a week for your whole household. That's a little surplus, too, because you just did one bathroom. And maybe you have two bathrooms. If you want to furnish both bathrooms, then you double that for the four people in your home. That's all you've got to store for a week. Now, depending upon how many weeks you want to have on hand, whether it's a month, three months, six, 